Four men, four men sitting at the entrance of the gate. Amen. They said to one another, we are here and we know the enemy is surrounding us. Everybody is in fear. The king is in fear. We the poor are the ones who are going to die first. So they said, why do we sit here? We know we're going to die because the enemy is surrounding us. We know there are some situations where you begin to reason out and say, you know, I know I'm not going to make it. I know I'm not going to come out. But why do I stay in this place to die? Why do I stay in this situation to die? I know it is impossible. I cannot gain anything better. It's been one month, two months. We are surrounded by the enemy. I cannot make it. So the Bible says they were surrounded by the enemy. Sometime in your situation, you are surrounded by the enemy. You are surrounded by the devil. You are surrounded by situations. You are surrounded by that very thing that you want to release yourself, be free. But it's holding you. It's binding you. Maybe it is sin that is binding you. Maybe it's the movies, the movies you watch. Maybe it's the drinking. Something is binding you. Today, I come to tell you that we have a mighty God. Hallelujah. If you trust him today, he will make a way where there seems to be no way. Come on, somebody say amen. So the Bible says, these men fall. Somebody say fall. You know, when you are poor, you come to a point where you know the rich are going to survive, but we the poor are the ones who are going to die first. The, the, the rich can still have some food. They have some extras. But for us, we are just at the gate begging. You know, when you are poor and you are just a beggar, those who are also rich, when they know that the food they have is little, they don't have more food to give you. So they spent one day, two days, they say, ah, we are not dying here. We don't see anyone giving us food. We are lepers. We cannot go in the garden and drink for ourselves. And first of all, we are surrounded by the enemy. They said, let us be wise now. Listen to what they said. They said, God, we are making up our mind. <laughs> Why do we sit here and wait? They asked each other. We will starve if we stay here. But if the famine in the city, because of the famine, amen? So they say, so we might as well go out and surrender to the enemy. If the enemy decide to kill us, we die. Because here we're going to die of hunger. If we go there, the enemy is still going to kill us. If they spare us, they spare us. In either way, we're going to die. But they were at the entrance of the temple. God had their reasoning. Hallelujah. Katonda so they are reasoning. God was, was hearing them. So the Bible says they decided, they said they, they had to choose whether we die here or we go and surrender to our enemies. Whether we die here of hunger because no one is giving us food or we march towards the enemy and the enemies decides whether he kills us or he gives us life. They say we have no other option. Have you ever been in a situation where you don't have another option? Don't give up. God is with you. Have you ever been in a situation where you say, say I'm done. I don't know if I'll ever make it again. Even the friends that you have trusted. Everybody say, uh-uh, we don't have time for you. The ones you try to talk to, uh-uh, we don't have time for you. Praise the Lord. They ask you, hey, man, which, which clan are you? Which family are you? Which tribe are you? What, they begin to say, oh, what caliber are you? What education are you? What level are you? They begin to ask you, there are times in our lives when everything is questioning you. When you try to go up, they push you down. When you try to ask for help, they say, do you have this? Do you have credentials? Do you have papers? Do you have money? Do you have ideas? Do you have this? You have nothing. And you say, you know, why do I die in these situations? There are times when you have to sit down and say, this month, January, I'm not going to die in this situation. Hallelujah. I'm not going to die in this situation. I'm going to trust God with all my heart. 
Omanyi umuntu aina option enyinja agamba ah nze nina sente zange. Ni omuntu nga option zikuweddeko ogamba kasichi nze ensiga za katonda. Kati gwe gwe njogera na olwa lero. Walwa bagama manyinze nasoma ni na degree yange njage na mfuno wali omulimu omulala oba ni na connection ni oba ochitegera sima uliriza chengamba walwa omuntu ngo lyango genze maso ga katona nenga ogama ti mukama bo no banga tochikoze njage nda ka walala nga agwesogera nawe njagalo omuntu agama anti kati nkomi ndi kuchisenge buli chimunchi geze zako Na ye amaso gangi ngano gatu nulizo kule merelua. Amaso gangi uluwale ronga tunuliza katonda. Amaso nga jaku mintu evi bate bine mesa. Kuwanga bani nange. Walu evi sera bie tumala. No tunulile chintu nga tichikenda kuyamba. No kabili laba antu. Bumalo kabo lina gaya na gamba. Kabade no kekabi. Ufuka ambozi. Oya manyeze nalinga nyamba abantu abantu atwa lwa jogendo lina gama nalinga nyamba abantu nenze si cha yamba iyo fayo njogera no muntu lero ngo gama nti mukama nabo be nalindo oza nabo te bacha nyamba ngo gama nti olwa lero kati kansa lewo nsi beguno omwezi obansi gale mu mbera no nyeka tonda obansi gale mu mbera haleluya Walwa gama ntize, umanyizo kusiba na kufako. Nze ya wa chechi nzita. Emele nyingi mu Amerika. Zi cheese bag. Tununa wali, emele limu friji. Walwa one, 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 one dollar menu. Walwa fuka two. Ku McDonald. Chechi nzita. Aha. Walwa gamba kusande. Sande musabe musibe. Walwa gama ntize, yes. Tuli mkusiba. Onyumiza lebano tuli mkusiba. Nenga tosiba kufari ku McDonald one dollar menu. Umala kwe pakila nolio kukuma wawaka. Kani tusabe tu tusibulu kukale Latin go singa no kuri emele yokusibulu kuluka Nenga go manjiji wa iti de Tonu nama kwezi kakatonda Njokira no mtu ngo gama Tio uruwa lero Guno mwezi mu Amerika Mwanyi walu kufango li mu Amerika ngo gama Mwanyi na jia mu Amerika katisi Yes tuwa chichechi insabisa Kati gwe sogira nawe Njokira no mtu wa gama ti Mukama Owebi ntuwebi Owebi ntuwebi Sige na kufira mumbele Kanku no nyeko Mwanyo tuagala nyo Uriye mmele utekeke tama ukuwechi fana nyo chuwele ze Uganda Mwaga mama bantu wana anda bauti anti nkosi Vajja gama di nevi zibu Abo toba fako abo gira Haba kendo gama nchi osi use kumulimu Toba fako Katio limu mbele gama Katio luare lo Nsazewo Guno mwezo kwa januari Obangina ne katonda Kangende Nesifira wano Gamba sifi ila wano. Banai kamba huli le njala samba de se anga. E njala e sovolo kutu sa kuchintu. Chufula ni katonda ya gala nye njala. Omanyi njogela kukusiba kulikuwe njini. Ne kuruma no gamba. Mukama njala nge nnumi. Kati hawe njini hivyo ujuli lange kurumi. Nenga chichizbaga chili wali na yeno ugano chiku watako. Awo gambi nanti mukama nsasi. Ha. Would you get a prodigal son? A church at church at home, your prodigal son. Zari in busy? No. Yagamba, she church in Zita. Huh? Ba, ba servant, ba tata wange, ba li mukulia, ba sanyoka. Ze mfira wane njala. Njala etu sembeza edichi tafi. Njala etu komia, buosi bako, guno mwezi, leke njala ekurume, Nge kuruma na hengo chimanyi nchi osembe leda katonda. Anango manyi dekambaburi le. Buwariye yuga anango ugamanti nze sicha ina option. Wasiba. Nga tomanyi na kumayanti mukama alikudamu. Ngo siba. No maro naku noru dako. Noru dako. Nika chyo zewa no mwa Amerika. Otuna left yolaba chichizbago. Olaba chi. Emi ongo to charge ilaba lumonde. Tucha amulaba. Olaba binti wili prepare di. Mufrije okaja yungo teka microwave ungo odia. Mwa gama nti ziche chinzita. Otani kakunyumiza bantu. Heno tuasa ba mkama ulaba tuwa do mkisa. Neda bambi. Umukisa leka gwe yonge le. Leko kutunuri le ebi kwa wo. Tunuri la yesu agaba ebi yoru vedera. 
Oyo leka tumunonye, leka tumere kumuliro, ngoli wa jajoli, ngoga majowandi mwa Ameriko bandi Uganda, nze nagano kushuka, nchano nyakatonda. Nchamu etaka. Toti anjala. Enjala inenge di jeku mufinga na eku jeku get. No gambo ba mfanfe na eka ngende. Enjala gama nti enjala nzi jeku get yoru wariru. Hallelujah. Bible ya inache gamba. Muguni. Ulira. Ulira chigambo chino. Lamentations 4.9. E gamba, those killed by the sword are better off than those who die of hunger. Enjala! Gwolewa ni Bible ya gamba, nti enjala ya kuruma, no gamba wachi ni nandifu dechi so. Katika tunda wakua agala au, ngate kuruma burumi, nti kamfide wano, aa, ni inge kuruma ngo gamba, nti mukame numa kumanga njaga la kula, aa. Njaga la kubela na awe mukama. Njaga la kuchusi wa. Jaga la kwe yonge na yo. Katonda wange. Sia ya nilabi ntubi ya nsebio. Bible ya gamanti soko no nyoba kabaka wa katonda. No obu tu kilivu. Ibi lalabi genda kuongiru wako. Muka makanku no nye. Ibi lalabi jakuja. Wali waka okusiba. Enjala na ekuluma. Katona nena ulirango mkuteko. Ochite gina singama. There are times when you really fast and pray. To a point where you say Lord. I can't take it anymore. Awo mkama wagamba katinkuri. That's when God says, now I can't hear you. Lord, you told me one day, 24 hours, my legs are shaking. I feel water running. I want to put my mouth under the water. I open the fridge, there are juices. God, I can't take it anymore. And then I heard on the news, that if you, say, if you spend 24 hours, you're going to get sick without eating. Lord, I don't care about that. All I need is you. Mumunonye nga wacha inzo kulabika. Mumukole nga wacha liokumbi. Mukama nkunonya. Au katonda wawuri ile doors. Mukama wawuri no mutima ugumi nyese. No guone le de. Naga makati guwekuli. Hallelujah. Rika nkuburi le. Echige no kufuro wa mani. Sikuwe kujobo ziwa. Nechike ndo kufuro wa mani. Gwe kenyini ngononye za katonda. Hallelujah. Katonda gendo kugulide kubo ngomu nonye za. Katonda gendo kugulide kubo. Ngokoko nye obuta kowa. Ngoga mantimu kama. Ngoye gate. I'm tired of sitting at the gate. There's another way. Of getting things. But those things can kill you because they are things. But there's another way of getting things by seeking God first. And then you have life. 